Hey YouTubers, welcome back to Donnie Boy 73 the Small Engine Doctor. Today I'm going to show you how to replace the brake cable or engine stop cable on your lawnmower with a Tecumseh engine. So this is the lawnmower I'm going to be working on today. It's got a Tecumseh and the way I can tell that is that the brake cable attachment is right here on the engine near the spark plug. On this mower here the cable broke right where it hooks up into the lever on the handlebars. If your cable wasn't broken it would have a Z-bend like this at the end. It would be inside one of these holes here. So to remove it, what you would do is just simply slide it out like that. So today all I have to do is to remove it over here because it's broken as I mentioned. So just basically pull it out like that. On the engine here, you want to disconnect the cable. Now just simply grab it and pull it out like this. Now you need to disconnect the plastic part of the cable here. I've got another cable here just to show you exactly what you need to do down there. You need to go down and squeeze the plastic parts like this and then pull out. And now pull it out. After you remove the old cable, look for numbers on the cable here. The numbers you need for the part number are these seven numbers here, 7460946. Now on your lawnmower, you may have a different part number for the cable, but I'm just showing you how to locate the part number on the cable. If you don't have a part number on the cable, you're going to have to locate the model and serial number on the body of your lawnmower. Go to your small engine shop and they're going to be able to tell you which cable is for your lawnmower. Now I've got the new cable and I'm going to show you how to install it. First of all, this part of the cable is going to go on the handlebars. Here's the hole that the previous cable was installed in. Now with this part of the cable facing toward the top of the handlebars, just simply go and insert this plastic part inside the hole on the handlebars. Just click it in like that. That's all there is to it. Now move the lever back up like this. Usually there's only one hole in the lever here, but in this case I'm going to put the cable inside the top hole. Just grab the end of the cable like this, insert it in the hole like this, and then move it down so you can see it's locked in there. And now it's nice and tight in there. Next you want to run the cable underneath the pull cord toward the front of the machine. Now grab the end of the cable, insert it in the hole here on the mechanism, just slide it in like that and this is the position you want it in now run the cable in the groove over here now all you have to do is push this part of the cable in until you hear it snap in there and that's it now I'm going to use a tie wrap to secure the cable to the handlebars so I'm going to put the tie wrap approximately down here and since the cable wants to come up here I'm going to put another one and that's all there is to installing a brake cable on your lawnmower with a Tecumseh engine. Now what I'm going to do is start it up to make sure everything's good. So thanks again for watching and we'll see you in my next video.